I've been sent four different lasers so far, and this is the first laser that I've ever put into full production. I want to tell you why. One of the first things I did was a set of arms with both this very cool serpent and hammer knot work. And then I did an all black pair of these same arms with the uh, raven motif we have here. I may insert a picture of it here because I don't have them anymore because somebody purchased them. Anybody that knows this channel knows that I like to do Viking artwork and I like to do armor, which means heavy leather, larger pieces. The Creality Falcon 2 has the ability to cut through that heavy leather. It has the ability to put those designs on it and a large enough space that is not like, I'm not throwing a 12 by 12 inch piece of leather every single time I want to cut something. I still love leather carving and I will continue to do lots of leather carving on this channel, but this laser enables me to currently add art to all of my armor for free until I start charging for it because it's no, no extra time for me personally. It's got some time on the laser, but right now I'm just producing armor with art, which is awesome. And I haven't even been using them that long, so I'm still figuring stuff out. So all of this is done with the laser. Fan braces with the holes done. We've all even got guidelines, super light guidelines. Because I sew these with a sewing machine, I need to be able to line up those pieces really easily. This works great. I certainly got sent practically everything. So there's obviously add-ons like integrated air assist, which is amazing. I would highly recommend that. Uh, they sent me their honeycomb plate, which helps with cutting. And what else did they send me? They sent me the hood, which is also pretty badass. So that can help you exhaust out of wherever you are cutting from. And on top of that, when it got to me, it was already 90% assembled. Took probably 15 minutes to finish it off. So now this last time when I went and bought some saddle skirting for armor, I just cut it into squares and then put them in a pile and put them into the laser whenever I need them. It's not taking me very long to convert all my patterns to laser patterns and then taking those squares and just making sure everything is filled nicely so I get the smallest amount of wasted space possible. You know, if we're talking about leather carving, just doing these two pieces, what is, what's that gonna take? Three or four hours to get these two done for a van brace? Now, obviously it's going to be a different look, but considering the gigantic price difference on being able to laser some art on and make it look cool with some paint or some dye, Compared to leather carving, it's uh, pretty crazy. So now I'm converting all of my patterns to be ready for laser use. I haven't done anything on my website with this yet, but on my Patreon, there is the legend tier, which is the laser tier for more information on that and some screaming deals on patterns and artwork. Check the description of this video. I think this Creality Falcon 2 is in the neighborhood of probably $1,300 or so. Don't quote me. Um, depending on the bits you have for it, uh, air assist and the hood, stuff like that what wattage it is 22 watt 40 or 12 i think is the other one um i wouldn't go any less than the 22 the 40 is probably perfect and there's a link to the creality falcon 2 in the description of this video obviously so make sure you have a look at that as always check out the description of this video for links to tools and supplies to both lonsdale leather with a 10 percent off coupon code and to my amazon associates page if you've got time for one more video, make sure you check out my recent pauldron video. It's my best made video to date. I'm super proud of it. And until next time, keep on being creative in whatever it is you do.